directly from the little village neighborhood mourning the loss of a mother of two killed in a hit and run crash on the Stevenson Expressway. Yeah, police are still looking for that driver and WGN's Julian Cruz is live in Little Village with more tonight. Julian. Well, Ray and Micah family members tonight struggling to come to terms with their loss as investigators in Bolingbrook work to understand how this happened. Police searching for the suspect, the driver of a hit and run semi truck who did not stop to render aid. Friends and loved ones tonight gathered in Little Village, too distraught to talk to us on camera, but the victim's family putting out this GoFundMe page to help with funeral expenses. The late Perla Andrade Garcia leaving her two children behind. The tragic incident happening on I-55, one of Chicago's busiest truck corridors, even in the overnight hours. Illinois State Police say Perla Andrade Garcia and her passenger were stepping out of their apparently disabled vehicle on the northbound shoulder of I-55 in Bolingbrook, and that's when it happened. The driver of a semi-truck just before 3.30 in the morning, according to investigators, striking Garcia and her companion, the driver fleeing the scene before police arrived. The 28-year-old Garcia pronounced dead on the scene her passenger rushed to an unnamed hospital with serious injuries. Illinois State Police are looking for your help. If you have any information on this hit and run driver, you're asked to call State Police. In Little Village, Julian Cruz, WGN News. All right, Julian, thanks.